What's up guys? In today's video, we will talk about a smart door lock from Elemora brand. I have M22 model with Bluetooth support. You know, this door lock caught my attention because it has many ways to unlock, such as mechanical keys, passcode, and even up unlock. So let's do unboxing and see what comes in the package. We will also talk how to install the door lock and the functions of the mobile application. So the new Elemore M22 door lock comes in this box. We can see main features of it on the side, such as a zinc alloy, mechanical keys, and password. Inside the box, there is a user manual and a layout of how to properly install a door lock. We will talk about installation a little later. And then there is an interior assembly of the door lock, touch keypad assembly, mounting plate, a deadbolt ledge, a deadbolt strike plate, a buckle box, and the screws of different size. There are also two other keys in the package, nothing is clear yet, but we will figure it out. In the user manual I found a components list, here we see how to assemble a door lock. There is also an installation guide in the user manual. Now I am going to show you each page, and you can pause the video and read carefully. First, you need to prepare the door and check the dimensions. This is a very important step, because I just found that I couldn't install a door lock. Because the thickness of my door is about 80 mm, Elmore M22 door lock is designed for doors with a thickness from 35 to 50 mm. However, I can show you the official installation guide video. Then you need to install the latch and strike. Step 3 is installation of exterior assembly. And step 4 is installation of interior assembly. Finally, you need to install the batteries and perform the door handing process. As you can see, installation is quite simple. Now let's see how to use the door lock. When you have already installed the lock and it is powered on, you see the light indicator as well as touch screen keypads to enter the password, the lock and unlock keys. The factory default password from Elemore M22 is 123456. You can change the master code. For that, enter the default password from 1 to 6, then press the unlock key, and now press the key with number 4 and enter the new master code, for example, 147258. Press the unlock key again. Enter the new master code to confirm it and press the unlock key. That's all. Now you have a new master code. You know, Elmer M22 supports up to 50 user codes. Let's see how to add the new user code. First, you need to enter the master code and press unlock key. Now, press the key with number 1 and press unlock key again. Next, select any key that stands for user ID and press unlock key. Finally, enter the password from this user ID. For example, 258147. Press the unlock key. Enter the same password to confirm it and press the unlock key. That's all. As I already said, you can add up to 50 user codes to this door lock. By the way, you can also add user codes for family members through the app on smartphone. Let's install the app and take a look at its functions. The application is called Smart Life, and it is available on Android and iOS devices. As I already said, I have a Bluetooth version of Elmore M22 door lock. So you need to turn on the Bluetooth on my smartphone. Then tap the plus icon in the top right corner to add a new device. Wait a little until the door lock is automatically detected. So in the app we can press the unlock and lock buttons. Then we can open the Member Management menu to add a family member. When you add a new member, they will have access to the door lock in the app. If you want to remove a member, you need to select a home in the upper left corner and go to Home Management. Here you will see all the family members. Just select one of them and remove it. Ok, we talked about adding family members, but you can also assign password to them. For that, click on the Set button and go to the Password Management. Now press Add Password and select a user. Enter a new password and tap Save button. That's it. Now you can enter a new password on the door lock touchscreen to unlock it. 
Elmer M22 Smart Door Lock also supports dynamic codes. You just need to click on Get a Dynamic Code and tell the code on the screen to the person who wants to open the lock. Please note that the code expires after 5 minutes. Finally, you can set up a temporary code. It is not the same as family member, because the user with temporary code doesn't have administration functions in the app. So first, open the Member Management menu and under the Others, press on the Add It Now button. Now you can add the nickname to this member. You can also turn on off a password management, unlock with mobile phone and dynamic password management to this member. I think it is better to turn them off. Now set the time for this user and add a password. The password will be valid for the period of time you choose. So we can see that the app is the main feature of Elmer M22 Smart Door Lock, because the control is intuitive. By the way, I forgot to mention the easiest way to open the lock. You can simply insert a mechanical key to open the lock. The good old unlocking method. Finally, let's talk about battery of Elmer M22. The new door lock is powered by four 2A batteries. According to the manufacturer, the battery life on a single charge is 10 months. By the way, a Wi-Fi version of this door lock has about 6 months of battery life. You know, Elmer M22 doesn't have a fingerprint unlock, but I don't think it is that important, because you can use a passcode, mechanical key and even the app on smartphone. The app makes it very easy to control the door lock. I think it is a big advantage of Elmer M22. Thank you for watching this video. See you soon.